How's it going guys? So they say here and welcome to my unboxing of Batman Arkham Knight. I bought the limited edition tonight at my local GameStop. Uh, I've never done an unboxing before and I do apologize for the quality of the video. I am recording it on my iPhone because I don't really have a camera or anything like that. But this is the uh, limited edition. And if you look on the back, it tells you basically everything that's in it. Um, it has an art book, 12 inch statue, the new 52 skin pack, comic book, steel book, and a Harley Quinn story pack. Um, which is kind of weird because I bought the season pass and I think the new 52 skin, oh no that's a different one, I'm thinking of uh, a different skin pack, but yeah it's pretty cool. I haven't opened it yet as you can see, so we're going to do that because it is an unboxing and I also got this as well, it was separate, it's like $30, Let's see if I can get a better light for it, but it's the Batman Arkham Knight Collector's Edition Strategy Guide, basically. And it comes in a nice hard case. I haven't even opened it yet. Wow! It's really hard to open. But yeah, it's basically, I think, pretty much the exact same strategy guide before. But it's just in a nice hard cover. And then it comes with, I think, three different photos on the front to Arkham Knight. And then there should be two others in there. One's Batman and another character. But I can't remember which one it was. And it also came with a digital copy of the strategy guide. So I'm going to be giving that off to one person on the channel. So if you guys would like it, please be sure to leave a like in the com or leave a like in the video and comment below. And I will choose somebody for that. So let's go ahead and get into the unboxing. I'm probably going to cut the video just so you guys don't have to see me. Um, you know, trying to open the box and everything with one hand. So I'm going to go ahead and cut to uh, me basically getting it open for you guys. Okay, so I got it open. Sorry, if it's really hard to see because I have really bad lighting in here. I'm going to try and adjust it in my editing software. But it has a cool little Batman symbol. And then it says, From a grateful city in memory of Gotham Knight. So, and it actually does, it looks like it comes with the actual game case, which I did not know. I thought it was just the steel book. But when you open it up, it has the uh, game right at the top. Just like that. Boom. So you do get the game case. That's pretty cool. And then we'll like take the top off. Oh no, I'm going to have to say. Okay, so that's what came out of the box. And on this side, we got the steel book. Which is really awesome. Whoop, that's falling apart. <laughs> well, that's the steel book. Don't know if there's anything in it. Nope, you just put the game in it. But that's really cool. Really, really dig that. And then this is the issue zero, I'm guessing. It's the. I guess this is the only way you can get this issue is by getting the limited edition. I guess it is technically the first issue. Because uh, there is, I know at least five or six Arkham Knight uh, comics as like a prequel to the game. So there's that. So there's, so we got the game, the comic, the steel book, and then what else is in this thing other than the statue? There's something else. Oh yeah, the art book. That's right. So let's go ahead and open this up. Ooh. Sorry, it's really difficult to do this with one hand. Ta -da. Sorry, I was trying to get the lighting how to cut away, but that's the statue. Um, it's really cool. Uh, the only thing is, it's like, I don't know, it just seems like a really cheap plastic. I had to bend his uh, ears back a little bit. They were bent a little bit. But other than that, it looks really cool. But yeah, down at the bottom it says... It's going to be hard to see with the uh, the light. But it says... Uh, what does it say? From a grateful city in memory of the Gotham Knight. So... Oh, I must have said Arkham Island. But, so people are saying that he's going to die in the game. So I'm not sure if that's true. But I kind of hope not. <laughs> okay, so I went in and turned off the light one more time. And this is the art book. From what it looks like. Oh, crap. Okay. 
got it out. So, yeah, this is the 80 page art book, and that's awesome. Like, that is hardcover, it's got a nice paper, like a cover to it. That is so cool. And a bunch of art and stuff that's in the game. Oh, it's so awesome. Like, for the price that you pay for this limited edition, you get your money's worth. I mean, you're getting a statue, which is awesome. I'm actually going to put it up here. But yeah, it's just, it's kind of a cheap plastic. It's the one thing I don't care about it. And like I said, my lighting in here is terrible. So I'll try to adjust that in the editing software, maybe. But yeah, and this is my statue case. Everything like that. But that's pretty cool. But yeah, you get your money's worth, definitely. You get the game, which is $60 alone, with a cool steel case, a comic, an 80-page art book, and yeah, so... This, probably this art book, if it was to sell alone, would be, I would say, at least 20 bucks by itself. And the statue itself, I would say, would be a good $30. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I know the quality of the video wasn't very great. <laughs> I don't have anything to really record with. But again, if you guys are interested in possibly getting the strategy guide, it's a digital one, it's not like a, a book, so... It's, uh, yeah, it's, I think it retails for $10 is what GameStop was selling it for. But since I got the limited, I get a free one. So that's pretty sweet. So yeah, I, the code's on the other side, but if you guys would like it, why did this come with batteries? I'm confused. What does the batteries go to? Am I missing something? Statue doesn't take batteries, does it? <laughs> I'm confused. It does. What does the batteries do? Hold on, we're going to figure this out. Okay, so apparently these batteries actually go in to the statue down there. And if you look on the very top, there's like lights. So I can't open it right now because I don't it, you need a really really small screwdriver and I don't have any tools at the moment. All I have is a regular screwdriver but it's way too big uh, so I will have to go buy one or something to try that out that's really cool I didn't actually know that it had lights to it so that's pretty sweet sorry I couldn't show you guys that but yeah that's basically it. if you were curious to know what was inside the box there you have it this wasn't included like I said that was for the uh, strategy guide and so is this but you got the game comic steelbook 80 page art book and then you got the box so yeah it's pretty legit I'm enjoying it I think it's pretty cool I definitely think the lights make up for the statue because you'd have to see it hand like you'd have to see it for yourself it's it's a pretty cheap plastic but I guess that's what you get for uh, a pretty cheap limited edition you know 100 bucks isn't too too bad for a limited edition with a statue in it. I figured it was gonna be a lot more unlike the uh, $200 one that got canceled, which really sucks. But yeah, that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, again, for the third time, if you wanna have a chance to win that digital strategy guide, leave a comment below and I'll pick a winner here very soon. Thanks for watching.